Land Food and Community Series is the core series of courses in the faculty of Land and Food Systems, where we bring students from all the different disciplines within the faculty together to work on interdisciplinary challenging questions within the food system. We have these community projects that we involve students in that allow us to get them in, uh, beyond the classroom and into a community setting thinking about food system issues with practitioners within the community. We're developing a food asset map for the North Shore um, and so we're working on a database collecting information about different resources um, that are geared towards food security, um, food recovery, um, sustainability, growing, harvesting, um, different opportunities to access food. At its most basic level, it's meant to be a tool for service providers who are supporting people who are a little more vulnerable in our population who are looking to access free or low-cost meals or grocery items. Um, at a different level from that, we're hoping that it'll be a really useful tool for community members and local governments when they're looking at um, some of the new development that's happening on the North Shore. It's been a really great experience. I think our group um, is super cohesive and the work with the North Shore Table Matters Network has been very supportive. Um, they've really guided us through the project. I love working with the students. They're really uh, passionate about this work and being able to contribute something meaningful to the community that's actually going to be used and that's valued by the, the members of the steering committee um, for specifically for the table matters but in general I think the students get a lot out of it and so do the community partners. I think there's a big difference between like project work um, that you're working on an academic project versus working in the community um, because you have to kind of take a step back from your academic um, kind of like silos of knowledge and um, also recognize that community, communities and community partners have a lot of information um, to share, a lot of knowledge, a lot of passion. Um, and I think a big thing that I learned was how to integrate many different forms of knowledge um, and just learning to work together in, in a professional setting. It's really um, great to be part of a learning community um, and having a little bit more diversity of voices and perspectives uh, at our table I find really valuable. Interdisciplinarity for us and transdisciplinarity when we, we bring in um, social actors beyond academia really helps us get our students to prepare for what is it, what is it like to talk uh, to individuals and, and work on a project, although you might not share the same disciplinary language, uh, dis disciplinary perspectives, or even uh, social locations within society, and how do you work together uh, to effectively address common issues.